Hi, Miss Spots. Hi. Hi, Cherry. Thanks for having me on. I'm so excited. Congratulations on your first book being made into a series. Mm, oh my God. I'm so, I'm so grateful. I'm so excited. It's, I almost can't believe it's real still. I've seen it. I've heard people have seen it. People have told me they've seen it, but I just, I'm not sure I'm ready to believe it yet. <laughs> I've seen it. And I have to say, <laughs> how exciting are you to work with um, Thomas Jane and Miss Sh- Sh- Shaman? Shamoon, yeah. Shamoon. Nicole Shamoon, yeah. Oh, when I met them, uh, I, I thought to myself, this is this is too perfect to be real. You know, they're both so into the characters and passionate. I was wondering if after, you know, decades of acting in the way that that, that that Thomas Jane has been in so many different things, was he like, yeah, this is just a job, you know, but he, he's right in there. He's really passionate. And I thought, how do you maintain that? that enthusiasm and that love. I think it's just a love. It's a love of acting. Um, and he wanted to give the performance of a lifetime. And so did she, you know, Nicole is, is newer to, uh, to acting than he is. Um, and she was just, she was just ready to do an amazing job of this. What was it like working with him? Because not only is he experienced, but he mentioned that uh, your book was the first project that him and his partner decided to work on to turn into a series. I was so chuffed to hear that as well, because I had heard that he really didn't want to do a series because it, he, he kind of found it exhausting. I think maybe um, so he was more interested in feature films. And then uh, his partner, um, uh, Courtney Lauren Penn from his partner at Renegade said, I need you to read this. And he read it and he said, yes, this is the one. <laughs> and I was so pleased that I've changed his mind about something so huge. Uh, will I do a feature or will I do an eight part series? It's a long time, you know, with the potential to open up to more seasons. It's a huge commitment. And uh, for him to love the book that much that he would commit to it like that, I was ah, what amazing when I heard that. Um, just these moments that I will remember forever uh, uh, about this. Mm. Did you get a chance to go on the set to sort of see how uh, the sausage is made? (laughs) I did not. I did not. Simply because uh, Australia just locked down with COVID and uh, it came within 10 days. There was 10 days uh, left of filming and they were about to lift lockdown and I almost made it. Uh, so no, I did not get to go there. I saw the raw footage at least, but, uh, I, I, uh, no, I was very sad about that because it looked like it was fun. And I saw all these photos of all the actors hanging out and they made really nice videos for me saying, we wish you were here. And, um, and I, I had a couple of things snuck away from set for me to keep, but this is why season two, we're all hanging out for a season two. I will be right there. They won't be able to get me off the set. I'm going to sleep there at night and we'll wake up and I'll be there. Um, I'm just never going to leave. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for speaking with me about Crimson Lake and the new series Trapo that will be on Freebie TV. Mm. I will be reading the book and I am looking forward to watching the entire series. I've already watched the first two episodes and they're just so dark and fascinating. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Happy viewing. Happy viewing and reading. (laughs)